Thursday night, week six, and I'm back on the road, headed to Texoma in White Wright, as we have a non-district game between the Nakona Indians and the Maud Cardinals in a neutral site game being played in White Wright. It's gonna be a rainy night. We'll see if the weather holds off. It could be uh, a lot of delays, could be uh, maybe even a cancellation. I don't know if the game's gonna get in, so we'll keep our fingers crossed and see what happens. And in the meantime, I'm gonna go into Bucky's and get me something good. What do you think? Root beer, some snacks for the road, who knows? But when you go into Bucky's, it's gonna be good. All right, here we go, Thursday. Time for the color commentary debut. Katie Cinco Ranch, Katie Made Creek, 7 o'clock p.m. on TexanLive.com. Trevor Bullard carrying the broadcast. Uh, we'll see if I can add some fun, witty comments um, in when he'll allow me to. So here we go, guys. First thing you got to do is load up on snacks for the road. This will last me a good month, month and a half. Probably last me to the playoffs. Some nice, solid road trip snacks right there. All right, it's taco time. What are we looking at here? Let's go chicken fajita, two tacos. Let's throw a little pico de gallo and cheese on them. And uh, yeah, I think that'll work. And no trip to Bucky's is complete without the best root beer in the world. All right, we made it, Road Stadium. Trevor Bullard checking in from the sideline. You pumped, hey, ready to go? Of course. Always excited. All right, Trevor on play-by-play. -play. Color, let's do this. We got some clouds moving in. Thursday night might be in jeopardy. We've done the blog for quite a few weeks, and I don't think we've had a Blaylock appearance in the vlog. We've got both of them. Hello. Tony's ignoring me. He acts like he doesn't like me, but we all know the truth. <laughs> when you need a guy to stand up and say, all right, don't worry, I'm colonized on this, I've got it, McKnight has shown tonight that he... Half time. Yeah. I got bread. I got water. Thank the Lord for toll lanes, because boy, traffic on 820 was no joke, because I'm headed from the DFW airport area to Toller America in Hood County as the Crawford Pirates take on the Toller Rattlers in a huge game in 2A Division I. The clouds are ominous. Hopefully the rain holds off, and we can get the games in tonight. All right, here it is, just from that step. Let me see what it's all about. All right, here we go. Three piece mixed. They were out of cornbread, so I had to get a roll. Red beans and rice. The uh, three piece combo is tender and the roll and dirty rice. We have to sit in the car because there were no seeds available. So let's see if it lives up to the hype. Update, Frenchies, fantastic. Great recommendation. Now we are at, let me turn this all the way around, Planet Ford Stadium. Super excited to be able to see this, a very new stadium in the Houston area. Um, interesting way to get in here, it's literally back in the woods, <laughs> but it looks super nice, so excited to go in. All right, y'all, just arrived here in Toller for the big showdown in 2A Division 1 between Crawford and Toller, and I have bad news. It's home. Yikes. Big shout out to the Toller Booster Club for the cheeseburger, fries, and Dr. Pepper. Appreciate the hospitality, y'all. Okay, when it comes to eyes lighting up on the run-throughs, H-Town holding it down, man. They have got this figured out. Also, incredibly nice stadium here at Planet Ford. Got the Toller Rattler inflatable here. We got the fangs. We got the logo. We got us some real grass, but it's a sloppy track. What I ask you to do is love each other and play for each other. Yes, sir. And 
Got us a little sign action here. So Aaron, last week you made the Dave Campbell vlog by flipping your hair. What do you have in store for our viewers today? I can't do that tonight. It's hairspray and death. But I can make a pitch to LaCroix to sponsor me because this is all I count. Thank you. I'm with her the whole time. Save me. Are you ready, Greg Tepper? Greg Tepper won't be dead. So when the Crawford Pirates bring out the big guns, they really bring out the big guns. They have this propane cannon that they fire off when the Pirates score a touchdown, and it is a very cool looking piece of art there for the Crawford Pirates. We've got the Crawford Pirate in the house. Crawford's gonna win, right? There you go, there you go. Walking off the field here in Toler. Crawford Pirates did Crawford Pirate things tonight with a 19-7 win over Toler to remain unbeaten and they will be definitely be keeping their spot if not moving up in the 2A Division I state rankings. So Friday night lights are over with for tonight. We're uh, gonna get back at it in the morning tomorrow. All right y'all, it's Saturday morning and I am headed Texas, Tenaha to be exact. Uh, the Tenaha Tigers have a two o'clock Saturday matchup with the Combsnell Bulldogs and a key district matchup. Combsnell comes in undefeated, but they have not been tested like they will today against Powerhouse Tenaha. So we're going to gas up here at Bucky's and Terrell, fill up the gas tank, and head to the Piney Woods and uh, see if we can get us something good to eat for lunch before the game. We'll holler at you later. come to Beast, Texas and you come to Longview, the spot to get barbecue is Bodacious Barbecue, but you gotta go to the one on Moberly. You can't go to any other Bodacious Barbecues. You gotta go to the one on Moberly Avenue. That's the spot in Longview. It's about to go down. If you know, you know. Posted up here at Bodacious Barbecue in Longview on Moberly. You know I had to get the three meat plate with a little spicy sauce on the side. That'll go in the beans right there. Brisket, hot links, and ribs. Yes, hot links, not sausage in East Texas. We get the hot links, and I got a bag of chips because they didn't have any mac and cheese. So this will fill me up on my way to Tenaha today. All right, y'all, as Ashley Pickle says, the gut is now full at maximum capacity. Bodacious and Marbley and Longview hit the spot. Now it's off to Tenaha for the afternoon game between Tenaha and Combsneal. But, uh, Maybe we'll take a side trip on the way and uh, have a little fun on the road down there. It's about an hour, hour and ten minute drive from uh, here in North Longview down to uh, Tenaha. So we'll see what the road holds for us. I can give you a look here at Tiger Stadium in Tenaha, better known as the Pit. That's the visitor section. Not much there, but a, what a cool, unique venue here in the woods of East Texas here in Tenaha. We'll get a view of the home side here in a minute. <laughs> Lots of winning football here in Tenaha. Their wall of honor here. See the full panoramic from midfield here at Tiger Stadium in Tenaha. Very unique little facility here. Shout out Tenaha for the Texas football sign there. We like it. Hey, thanks for watching this clip here on YouTube. If you like this kind of stuff and you want more of it, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. And remember, you can watch us live every weekday at noon at texasfootball.com, Facebook, Twitch, or here on YouTube. And if you want more of the best coverage of football in the state of Texas, check out texasfootball.com and become a Dave Campbell's Texas Football Insider at texasfootball.com slash subscribe. <laughs>